police in Westmoreland County really want to catch the people who keep breaking into businesses in Greensburg. All of the incidents have happened over the past few days, and at least one of the suspects is believed to be a repeat offender. Our Royce Jones is here with a description of the suspects that police want you to hear. Yeah, Erica, I have three separate burglaries to tell you about involving two different businesses. The first one happened Sunday when Greensburg police say the suspect wearing bright yellow shoes broke into the puff and stuff store at the Greensburg shopping center. He apparently pried open the side door and filled a bunch of white trash bags with cigarette cartons and other items. They hope that somebody might actually recognize his sneakers in order to identify him. But then get this two days later, just yesterday. In fact, they think that the same guy came back again and burglarized the same place, except this time as seen in these photos, he had on bright red sneakers, what looks like even bigger black trash bags and brought a friend. But I assure you, you know, we've we've stepped up our patrols, you know, or any assistance with the nearby businesses and their videos. Of course, they're all being more diligent in that area because of of how quickly that's very unusual for it to happen, you know, within a two day time frame. But hold on now, there's more police are now investigating that third burglary that I told you about. This one's over at Pit Take Barbecue, also in Greensburg, where you can see the front door was smashed out with a brick. It's boarded up now. The owners say that the money was stolen from their cash drawer. And yes, you guessed it. Investigators believe that one or both of the suspects from the tobacco store burglaries had something to do with this one as well. Of course, if you know anything about this, police do want to hear from you. In the studio, Royce Jones, KDK News.